Kotaku is not very happy about the decision. All right, here we go. Free Stellar Blade movement can't decide if new outfits are sexy enough. A manufactured controversy around censorship of the PS5 exclusive continues to unravel. Right, Stellar Blade is an excellent sci-fi action game that a small, ill-defined number of unhinged gamer lash onto as the latest front in a made-up culture war on boobies. After petitioning the studio behind the PlayStation 5 exclusive to free the game from unstantiated claims of censorship, some of them are declaring victory now that a new patch has added additional sexy costumes, but not everyone's satisfied. So, uh, the thing is, it's not an ill-defined number. It is a big dick defined number is because there's a lot of people who are actually upset. And we do know that this quote unquote censorship is legitimate is because we did hear from an interview from the devs saying that Sony was giving in a side eye during like a conference or some kind of like press briefing or some shit like that. Right. Mm -hmm. So they do know that there are censorships in the game. And if it wasn't censored, then the black pearl, the red pearl, would have not been censored in the begin uh, to begin with. The Moten uh, pu Punani Pine, whatever that one is, like that one shouldn't have been censored either, right? So, um, but yeah, it's uh, it, it, it's it's pretty sad. But let's see, uh, a May twenty fourth update to Stellar Blade brings a nineteen boss rush challenge mode new quality of life features and additional nano suits for its protagonists eve since combat and boss fights are the heart of stellar blade the new mode is great ways for players to put their uh put their test uh put to the test the skills they've spent for uh, uh spent the game honing and things like staying locked on the enemies when switching from long range weapons to melee attacks are welcome improvements now hold okay here again we need to watch this full screen we need to watch this full screen, chat. I'm, I'm sorry, chat, but we need to watch this full screen right now. You, cra we're, we're, you we're, crank up that resolution to 1080. Yeah, we we, we got to go over here. We got to go over here. We got to go 1080. And we're going to pause. We're going to watch it in two, two, uh, two speed. No, they don't have two speed. This game sucks. All right, here we go. Man. Man. Wait, it's not showing for me. Oh. Oh, sorry. So, uh, so sorry. <laughs> I, I, I was doing something under my desk. There we go. Yeah, I would say this game is pretty damn good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, chat. We're playing it one more time. If we're playing it one more time, just in case you missed it. Just in case you missed it, we'll play it one more time. All right, here we go. Here we go. Uh, yeah. The thing is. I don't know. I can't see why anyone will be upset at this. Yeah. Like, why? Why would you be so upset at that? Right? Like, I, I don't, I, why, why are you, why are you mad? Why, why are you? Oh, oh, Jesus, Jesus. I, 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 sorry. You got to watch it again. I, I accidentally hit a uh, play again, chat. We just need, we, we're just going to watch it again. But yeah, I don't know why people are so upset. Right. And, um, do you feel that people are 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 that in you know insecure of their own bodies, right? Probably, yeah, yeah, yeah. Jeez, I see. And then there's the new suits. In addition to the white kunoichi and black kunoichi, there's now a midsummer red hood and midsummer Alice outfits, uh, available to buy and craft. Uh, these are effectively variants of the original bunny and cybernetic bondage suits, two of the suits that some people loudly derided as censorship. It is fucking censorship, dude. Mm -hmm. There's no other way to say it other than censorship because a yeah, free release yeah. patch made them slightly less revealing, even though Stellar Blaze director said the changes were made for aesthetic reasons. Uh, it's called because they were Sony exclusive and they were strong armed into it. This like we talked about it at length already. Jesus. Man. How do you feel? Yeah. And clearly, probably this whoever the writer is for this, they never played Nikkei. Cause you know that that was their intentional design to begin with. And the Sony mandate slapped them with it. 
And yep. yeah, why aren't why aren't you outraged with the Abby and Owen sex scene in The Last of Us Part Two? Then you you find that acceptable, and this one not? It's like get out of here. Yeah, and the thing is that like there is no nudity at all in this game, none yeah, exactly. whatsoever. Right? There's no sex scene. And- there's no nudity, but this game is mature. So why are yeah why are you going to bat like saying that? Oh, it's not. It's, it's you know. It's it, these are. These are fine. I, I'm fine with this. It's 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 not. It's a mature game. It is, a mature game does not need to be censored. Okay. If like I said before, if you can have sex with a bear, if Abby can get railed in her asshole, and I can see a bunch of like freaking uh, freaking penises in Baldur's Gate three, this game is nothing compared to that. Yeah. You know, in, in Cyberpunk, you're having sex, literally having sex in first person. In Cyberpunk. Mm. First person sex. Okay, that I didn't even know. (laughs) Yeah, but yeah. Supports the point. Yeah, this is crazy. Proponents uh, of the free Stellar Blade petition are calling this a massive victory and preparing to pack up their bags before moving to a new front line in the gaming culture wars. Please sign a petition, which will now be sent as a gift to shift up Tweeted 56 year old Mark Kern. So many have helped make this possible. Uh, like, like yeah, I said I re- before, and, I, and like, I it's, like it's not a win that you think it is. Yeah. So this is version mm, one. That, oh, this that is was one the original. Uh, so yeah, even proves the point. Yeah, the three still. Okay, blade so here's the thing. It didn't even. It doesn't look like she's. It doesn't look like she's wearing underwear. Yeah, it didn't. It didn't. It. I. I tried it out. It didn't. So that's even the original. There's even an original version of that. So can you? This is gonna get very degenerate. Is can you upskirt on this? And what does it show under underneath? It shows underwear. Yeah, but you cannot see through it the way in version one point zero zero. It's it's oh, okay. uh, it's opaque, shall we say? It's okay. not transparent. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Uh, but not everyone's ready to give up that fight. We've won nothing, one player tweeted back. The original censorship is still there. But they've won from your reaction. Now they know that they can be they can bribe and distract us. Your reaction means we've lost. Others are going to are going over uh existing costumes with a magnifying glass looking for new signs of censorship. <laughs> uh, this includes transparency checks on the fabric that's partially see-through. Uh, to see if they've made uh, made more opaque. In a particular instance, there seems to be a disagreement over whether it's censorship to make the sheer fabric more opaque even while making Eve's underwear significantly smaller. A lot of people, can, uh, people can't uh, take a win when they get one, Kern tweeted. They want to quit when they have the foothill, but not the mountain. It's unclear how many more sexy outfits uh, will need We'll need to get before everyone's petition originally riled up into an unhinged frenzy will finally be satisfied. Like most uh, cons- conspiracists, uh, they are probably unlikely to ever be satisfied. Instead, destined to spend the rest of their day searching for truth in the pixels of a sci-fi lace teddy. Now, here's the thing. Uh, the person who wrote this is a male feminist. 100%. Um, the reason why he wrote this, uh, this opinion piece right over here, so this opinion piece slash um, article, is because he probably never touched a woman before. And what happened is that now that there is such thing as uh, being a, a male feminist, he hopes that girls, these woke girls, hear him like, oh, you understand us. You understand us fat girls. You understand us woke, blue-haired liberal freaking crazy people yeah we're still not going to have sex with you because you don't you're not making six figures you're not over six foot and you don't have a six pack because a lot of these people who are male feminists are short ugly fat people that it's like did i uh did i do good can you can you uh you know acknowledge me it's and that that's how they all are but the thing is Going back to the article, this is a small W, not a big W, in my opinion. This is a slight win. I think that um, the fight is never over. Is because if we don't fight and push back, 
they will always they, these people who ha, who has control, such as Sweet Baby Inc., people at Sony, people at Bridge, people at uh, online, people these um, community managers that work at these companies are extremely woke. If we don't say anything, it's gonna it's only going to get worse. But Gray, mm -hmm. which costume is your favorite? I, I I think the red one looks pretty nice based off of this uh this uh, uh, uh this video so far. I, I'm going for Alice. It has the I think it it. It stands a chance against Blue Monsoon. Oh, so we do yeah. have to update our um, <laughs> our tier. Oh, we're gonna spend two hours. <laughs> Thanks for checking out this segment of the Project Egg Row podcast. If you like what we do here, please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you will know next time when we go live. We do go live every Saturday at 8 p.m. Once again, we are just getting started. Tons of more video to come. Thanks, and we'll see you guys next time.